This first test is with a 4S battery connected. I'm gonna check out the voltage output on the different voltage pads on the FC. Uh, right now I am testing the five volt, I'm sorry, the 7.6 volt out for the video. And as we can see on the multimeter, it's coming out at 10.9. If I now test the camera, that one is at 10.9 as well. The receiver, that one is outputting 4.85. And if I turn it over, the 5 volt pad here on the back is 4.85. And right now I've got the five bolt um, jumper um, soldered there on the back. So I should be getting five bolts. I'm thinking that the <clears throat> camera and receiver at 4.8 is normal, but I don't know. But obviously the VTX at 10.9 and the camera at 10.9 uh, I don't know where that's coming from. This is where I 4S battery. If I switch the battery now, and now I type, plug in a 5S battery, same exact test again. This time when I do the VTX, I get 12.8 volts. So as you can see guys, the regulator is off in this case. Let's see the um, the camera. Twelve again. Uh, receiver. Four point eight five. So that was consistent. And let's see the back. Four point eight five. So I guess the five volt regulators are good. Whereas the 7.6 or whatever regular is needed for the video here and the camera up here, that one, <clears throat> to be off. So it's the VTX and the camera regulator that appears to be faulty, which would explain why when I plugged in a 5S battery with the quad this was on, it just went uh, a little weird and didn't fl fl fly right. So that's it, hoping I can get this replaced soon.